Hey guys, it's Zach with Revlimit Designs here. I uh, just wanted to show you guys our new mount. This is for the Scan Gauge 3, and um, it works kind of similar to our Scan Gauge 2 mount. Um, I'll show you kind of how it installs here. It's very easy to install. Um, we did kind of beef this one up a little bit just because of the weight of the Scan Gauge. Um, we've been testing it for a little bit now and holds up pretty well going down some rugged terrain and everything. So I'll show you uh, how this installs here. So basically the easiest way to do this is um, you can go ahead and remove your ashtray um, right away. You just go ahead and pull out on this and then just push down here. This just comes out. Um, the next thing you're going to want to do is actually just put your key ignition, go to accessory, make sure your foot is on the brake first before you do this and your parking brake is set. Um, go ahead and put on accessory and again, making sure your foot's on the brake and your parking brake is on. Bring this down to drive. And that should, or you can go even to two or low. So I went ahead and got everything plugged in here just so I could show you um, kind of how the setup is. So right now I need to do some cable management with my own cables, but there's a ethernet cable here for the, the power and OBD2. And I actually have my phone charger. There's a little hole up here for that. Um, so it makes things easy and kind of uh, channels that for you. So with it in drive still, you can basically bring this down and uh, it's a little difficult to do here with one hand, but let's see if we can swing this around. And this will actually basically just pop into that. And you can see that's sturdy here. So it um, allows you to kind of bring this cable up, use it however you need. I have my phone mount up here, um, but yeah, it works really well. Um, able to use, use the scan gauge for everything I was using with my scan gauge too, but I do like the alarms on it. And that's kind of the reason I switched over to this and wanted to bring this um, mount to you guys as well. So. And one last thing I just wanted to show you guys real quick is um, with it in part, you still have plenty of room to grab here. I don't know if it's probably hard to see from this angle, but there's um, probably a good, I don't know, couple inches down here and then plenty of room up here, three, four inches. So just wanted to let you know there's enough room to be able to grab this, shift it. Um, so that isn't an issue. And of course, when it's in drive, you'll be able to see everything that's on the gauge. So, um, but as you can see, you can still look around the shifter here. Um, but when you're in drive, I mean, you're able to see everything. So just want to put that out there. Um, link will be in the description below if you guys are interested in this. But um, yeah, that is our new Scan Gauge 3 Revlimit Designs mount. Thank you so much.